Check it out, Mr. D-Mate. The Akuma Hollis, I almost messed it up. I did. Uh, yeah. But uh, 113 pounds, man, talk about this tournament. You won the Outstanding Wrestler, but uh, it's a, a very tough weight class. How'd you feel coming in, and did you know who was going to be there? Yeah, I mean, I saw the entry list coming in, and I knew it was going to be a competitive weight class, you know, the Rujao, Haas, Quinn, Delvecchia. I knew, I, I, I definitely thought, though, if I wrestled my best, I could have won. But it was, it was good to get the competition before the season with all these guys. Yeah, what's it like? You know, a lot of people come to these early season tournaments hoping to kind of see some fluff matches, get some easy ones. But talk about having some hammers right out the gate. I mean, you know, the easy matches, you can't get better from those. The hard matches where you get improved, you wrestle better kids, you get better. That's how it works. That's why, you know, going to all these flow tournaments is worth it. There you go. Did, um, did, did the matches get tougher throughout the day or were they just nails the whole time? You know, my first match was all right, and then from there on, it's a tough match, a tough match, a tough match. It was good, dude. It was good. Did you ever get good. in any situations where you had some doubt creeping in your mind, or did you feel pretty solid the whole time? You know, I felt good. There were some scrambles I got into where, you know, 50-50. I came out on top of most of them. It was good. What was the toughest match of the day? A real tough match with Vito Arujo. Uh -huh. I cradled him out the back. Out the vex, out the box. Oh my gosh! Sure. For five, and then I ended up beating him six one. That was good. Cool man. I can work on my shots though. That was not good. So do you? So do you do that? Do you come to a term like that? And you just said it, but do you like assess yourself afterward? You said I got to work on my shots. Are you thinking things in your head like that? Yeah, I mean, you know, it's important that you're criticizing yourself. You want to beat yourself up over stuff like that, but it's important that you're looking for what you do wrong. Like if you just think you're the best, you're never gonna get better. You always got to be looking for tough matches, how you can get better. Very insightful, man. I like it. Thanks. Well, uh, you are the OW for the lightweight. You got anything else for us? I got to do the flow thing. Bam. Awesome, man. Thanks a lot. Thanks.